Hey everybody, we are here in Granite Falls, North Carolina, our hometown, and we are here at the River Bend shops out here by Walmart. We're gonna have lunch today at the Tokyo Diner that you see behind us. This is a good little Japanese restaurant here in town. It's always been good the couple of times we've been here. So we wanted to do another review today on something that we haven't done. So we're gonna go into the Tokyo Diner and see what they got, and we're gonna check it out. So stay with us. Now over here on the side of the building, they have a nice little uh, shaded outside eating area. We had talked about doing that. It's just a little chilly to be outside eating today, especially in the shade. So we're gonna uh, eat inside. Maybe we'll come back when the weather's warmer and eat outside again. But there's a lot of shops over here. Uh, years ago, Granite Falls, North Carolina had nothing at all that resembles anything uh, like a shopping plaza, but we do now. We got a Burke's outlet. I can show more of that from a better angle. So. So we've got a Burke's Outlet, a Dollar Tree, a Shoe Sensation. Um, I'm not sure what that other place is. Sedgwick, Holmes. Sedgwick Homes. And then down there at the very end is Walmart. So panning around back up this way, we've got Mexican Restaurant, Mazatlan, a bunch of other stuff. Frankie's Pizza up there on the end. But today our focus is going to be the Tokyo Diner Japanese Grill and Sushi. So let's step inside and check it out. The inside. We're just waiting to be seated now. All right, we just got seated. The toast is going to be about 10 15 minutes. I don't think it was five, so that's pretty quick. So let's get the menu here. And I am going to stop this for a minute and put the flashlight on. On the inside. And I also tell you the difference. Hibachi interior. The difference is there. So I'm sorry, say that again. It says what hibachi is and what teriyaki is. Oh yeah. You said water with lemon? Mm-hmm. If you want something else, that was the time to tell. No, no. Quite a bit on here. All right, let's see what the back's got. Oh, a lot more. All right, that's the menu. Okay, Shaughnessy, tell us what you got. Hibachi chicken. I always get hibachi chicken, and I love their carrots. Those are always really good. And then we got a. a Appetizer of two egg rolls. I tell you, I don't like carrots, but carrots in Japanese restaurants are always good. They are good. Yeah. Um, so tell us what hibachi is. So hibachi comes with um, mushrooms and it's soy sauce, and teriyaki has uh, broccoli and a teriyaki sauce. But I ordered teriyaki steak and shrimp combo, and I'm getting mushrooms with it. She said I could sub that she out. She can change it out. So yeah. what's there's my. Um, finger again. Sorry about the finger, y'all. I'm still learning this phone. Um, so what's the difference between hibachi and teriyaki? Chauncey's going to break this down for us. Oh, I thought that's what I was just saying. So hibachi would be No, like, I mean the two different seasoning or flavor sauces. 
soy sauce is hibachi. So you would have um, soy sauce for hibachi and um, teriyaki, of course, you'd have teriyaki sauce. Okay. All right. Which I think teriyaki is maybe a little sweeter. Okay. I always like teriyaki. So, and we got a, a side order of egg rolls, right? Egg rolls, yeah. Okay. We're looking forward to it. It's always been good. We've only been here two times, three times, maybe? Something like that. Not, not very often. But it's always been good. It's usually on Sunday afternoon. I think we came a Friday night one time. One time, yeah. yeah. Well, here's the cigars. I mean, the egg rolls. Those are tiny. Yeah, I was expecting to be a little bigger around than that. But uh, anyway, we're going to try them out. So. All right, the food has arrived. And again, hibachi chicken. Hibachi chicken. All right, and we're going to have to ask for some shrimp sauce because they didn't bring any out. But this is my teriyaki steak and shrimp combo. Looks really good. So we'll let you know how it goes in the final review. All right, I wanted to step out the side door over here just a little bit and get a little bit more of the outside area. Got a, uh, a lot of little Japanese maples uh, right here. Kind of a pretty little area over here on the side. And again, there's the <clears throat> outdoor seating area and nobody's really utilizing it today. It's a little cool in the shade, but it would be a great thing to take advantage of in, in warmer weather. All right, just finished up at the uh, Tokyo Diner Japanese Grill and Sushi here in our little hometown of Granite Falls, North Carolina. This is maybe the third or fourth time we've been here. Never have reviewed it, so we thought today would be a good day to do that. So, um, <clears throat> why don't you start and tell what you thought of it. So we got an appetizer. We got two egg rolls. Um, I've forgotten how tiny they are, but they were they were freshly made. They were my very hot. My finger. <laughs> they were good. <laughs> um, <laughs> And then I got um, hibachi chicken, which was good as always. So it's got the chicken in it, uh, mushrooms, the sweet carrots were delicious. Um, come with the shrimp sauce, uh, fried rice, everything was good. Um, I enjoyed my meal. Yeah, that's it? That's it. Okay, yeah, I would agree. Uh, I think we did get the egg rolls here before. Now, I will say there's a Chinese restaurant across town that has the egg rolls like you're used to thinking about egg rolls, bigger around. They brought these out, uh, one a piece. Um, they look, they did, they looked like little cigars. That's about how big around they were. And uh, they had came with a little sweet and sour sauce. Now they were good, they were flavorful. Mm -hmm. They just wasn't a lot to them, to be honest with you. And um, you know, I would probably try to remember that next time. If you're expecting uh, what you think of as a real egg roll, that this wasn't it, but they were, they were, they were good. Mm -hmm. um, I got the teriyaki steak and shrimp combo and uh, I, it came with rice, um, the uh, carrots, broccoli and mushrooms. So a lot of goodness there in one. I want to say about carrots, I don't eat carrots. Uh, I can eat them in beef stew or at a Japanese restaurant. I, I never just sit down and eat a carrot. I know they're healthy. So I'm very pleased to find a way I can eat them. And Japanese restaurants, they can take, if you can make a carrot taste good, you got something going for you. Uh, and they do, I mean, they're just very soft. You just put them in your mouth and they pretty much dissolve. That's how good they are. Um, that was the case here today with these. The uh, teriyaki steak was good, had shrimp, really good. Don't have a complaint. Uh, I'm glad we have a little place like this to go to that's close to us now. Mm -hmm. We we used to have to go to Hickory for something like this, and we don't have to anymore. This is this is as good as anyone they've got. So, oh, yeah. Uh, once again, Tokyo Diner. I, I keep having to look up and remember the name of it. Tokyo Diner uh, Japanese Grill and Sushi Bar. Well, it's not really a bar. Japanese Grill and Sushi. Mm -hmm. I'm blundering it today. <laughs> but anyway, um, good little place. I would encourage you, if you're in Granite Falls, passing through for any reason, this is a good place to stop if you feel like Japanese food. So if you like this video, uh, like and subscribe. And find us on Facebook. And we appreciate it and have a blessed day. Folks, this is a first. We've driven through this Walmart parking lot a thousand times. Never seen about their playing a violin before. It's cool. <laughs>
So we realized he was actually playing a violin and not taking pictures. Yeah. So I told her to drive down that way after we uh, left, or uh, after we got back to the car, and we did. And the family waved at us, very friendly. Yeah. I'm, I'm sure he's he didn't want donations, but he actually sounded like he's pretty good at it. Yeah, he did. So anyway. <clears throat> Granite Falls is moving up. We have a, a violin player now. Folks. Yeah. So, you can be you know, serenaded while out. you yeah. shop or go out to eat. But like I say, we've had that Walmart here since about 2007 when they built it. Mm -hmm. Never seen anything like that before. So people look at us funny and we do videos. And um, I, I don't know. That's different. I don't even know what to say about that. I don't know what to say. But anyway, thank you all for watching. So have a blessed day.